Hello, what's up people? This is WWE 2K15 My Career and we got our promotion to Raw. Yes, Raw is war, but in the previous episode it was like my shortest reign on the World Heavyweight title and I won it at SummerSlam and lost it in the next match. What the hell? So now as I'm at Raw, now we must upgrade our skills. Torpedo DDT, Corkscrew Leg Drop, but I'll keep my Super Drop Kick instead of Corkscrew Leg Drop. Instead of the Torpedo DDT, I like my Super Drop Kick. So what else can we bring to the table? King of Swing, Double Finisher, no I'm not keeping that. Outside Superplex will be good. And oh shit only one so either we could keep super drop kick or the outside superplex then i'll bring remove the turnbuckle okay this is it guys i have bought almost every skill in this game and i have a new attire on if you can see new types heartbreak kit types so here we go for our debut match at raw and look at that, I've got a title rematch against Randy Orton. I'm gonna take that and I hope I can win it back this time. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the World Heavyweight Championship. St. Louis, Missouri, weight 245 pounds, he is the World Heavyweight Champion, Randy Orton! So this is my third match in a row against Randy Orton and I hope I can beat him this time. There's the belt and here we go. Nice move. That'll leave a mark into the collar and elbow tie up. Only one can come out ahead. Tie up. This is about skill and power. The name Orton and the word history go hand in hand. I think about WrestleMania 20, when Randy made his WrestleMania debut in the same building his dad did for the first showcase of Immortals back in 1985. At WrestleMania 20, Randy scored the pinfall for his team that night and gave a glimpse of the WrestleMania greatness that was to come. Luther's Prime! Never ever underestimate the sheer force behind this superstar's punches. And it's Hero who counters. Randy Orton, no problem getting out of that one. And Hero has the wherewithal to avoid taking any damage. Ow. Jerry, you talked before about Randy Orton's WrestleMania debut. Yes, sir. Even Orton himself, with all of his arrogance and cold-blooded demeanor, will admit it was special for him to be in New York City for his WrestleMania debut. Regardless of if you like Randy Orton or not, we certainly witnessed history in the making. Well, Michael, seeing Randy Orton at WrestleMania 20 was special, and it was indeed historic. His dad, Cowboy Bob, was one of the most hated villains at the first WrestleMania in 1985. And when you saw Randy come out as a part of Evolution 20 years later, you could tell this was the moment he had been waiting for. Look at that, Cole! The quick reversal there by Randy Orton. And it's Hero who counters. Oh, man! 
He's going to take a chance here. Okay, so I have the signature now. Going for the Bombay oh, press. Boom! Hits it. And I think he's begging him to bring it. Just look at this. You can see the results from that move. Nicely avoided there. And he gets level. some adversity right now. Let's do this. OMG. Uh oh. Here comes the apron superplex. And I hope I can finish it with this. Shit! I said it before, these guys are overpowered. For certain about Randy Orton is that he possesses one of the most vicious, quick hit finishers in WWE. Yeah, man. King, I'm talking, of course, about the RKO, the deadliest of all his weapons. Oh my gosh! And Randy takes a hard shot. The Viper slithers out of the way. Oh, slithers. I see what you did there, Cole. Very clever. The quick reversal there by Randy Orton. Oh, no. Randy Orton looking to finish it. Oh, crap. DDDD. Look out. Here it comes. Boom. DDT. Shit. Orton. Watch it. Come back. Come back. Here I come Michael, back. You brought up Randy Orton's RKO finisher before. And you hit the nail on the head. It oh, might oh. be the best quick strike move out there. The Viper can hit you at any place, any time. And when okay. he does, we're talking about lights out situation. Boom. Oh, to fight back like that and then come up short is terrible. Signature. Shit. He reversed it. No. Oh, no. Has found an here. RKO. Shit. Come on, no, not again. Well, let's take a look at some of those, and here's some highlights from the matchup. Here is your winner, and still world heavyweight champion, Randy Orton. There should be no doubt in anyone's mind that he is the true and deserving champion. Absolutely. So WTF, I have lost to Randy Orton again, second time in a row. Again with that reversal, he puts in every move, gave me that RKO out of nowhere. And there we go, instant classic match. And what the hell. So Randy Orton retains his championship. Let's move on. And what's this Bray Wyatt? The buzzard is circling? What the hell? Oh, it's the Wyatts. We had a cryptic message from them over social media earlier today. Is this what they could have meant? So it looks like the Wyatt family is after me before it was the shield now as I enter raw the Wyatts are attacking me now oh shit so attack team match against them His tag partner is nowhere to be found. I have a strong feeling that the Wyatts had something to do with this. Well, their every move is calculated. I think he's going to have a hard time staying ahead of Bray Wyatt's games. It's his tag partner. He's here. And even the Wyatts could not hold him down. 
This match just got more interesting. So R-Truth makes his way somehow back to the ring and we are ready for the tag team match now. It was a handicap before. Ow. What offense Luke Harper is showing at this point. Oh, the reversal by R-Truth. R-Truth being pressed hard. That elbow did some damage. Just look at this. You can see the results from that move. Hero's going up. Leg drop. Luke Carter gets out of that one. Nice move. Spine buster. That'll take its toll. He knows his opponent is completely helpless to resist the submission hold. No, not again. Here we go. Pitching truth. Look at this. And there's the save. And this has got to be it. And that's the match. And here's just some of the action we saw during the match. And here's some highlights from the matchup. Whoa, I can't believe what we saw. In Here is your winner. Oh, true. I love a good tag team match, and this one was unforgettable. These teams gave us everything they had, and the WWE Universe is the true winner in this one. So for now, we have got rid of the Wyatt family. I think i will be seeing more of them in the next episode this will be it for today guys a good match in the end a tag team win and a three star match okay so we'll continue from here only guys till then please subscribe and like this video bye bye